Welcome to Sparks of History, where world history and Jewish history meet. We are extremely pleased to have with us today Professor Lawrence Schiffman. Professor Schiffman holds the Judge Abraham Lieberman Professorship in Hebrew and Judaic Studies at NYU, New York University. Professor Schiffman is a popular sought after speaker with a focus on the Dead Sea Scrolls, Jewish religious, political, and social history in late antiquity, and the history of Jewish law and Talmudic literature. Professor Schiffman is affiliated with many, many associations, including the Dead Sea Scrolls Foundation, the International Organization for Qumran Studies, the Israel Exploration Society, the Jewish Law Association, and many, many more. Professor Schiffman has authored numerous books, including Reclaiming the Dead Sea Scrolls, Who Was a Jew, Rabbinic and Halakhic Perspectives on the Jewish Christian Schism, From Text to Tradition, A History of Judaism in Second Temple and Rabbinic Times. And today we will be focusing on the Dead Sea Scrolls as Professor Schiffman has aptly been described as a celebrated specialist on the scrolls. And um, I went on to Amazon and purchased the Qumran and Jerusalem Studies in the Dead Sea Scrolls in the History of Judaism, and urge all our listeners and viewers to simply go on to Amazon, click a button, comes directly to your house, and it's a, a wonderful um, study on the Dead Sea Scrolls. Again, Professor Shippen, thank you very, very much for joining us today. Uh, welcome. A little bit about your background and how you became interested in the Dead Sea Scrolls. Well, this is a kind of a uh, funny story. So I did my undergraduate and graduate work at Brandeis, and I had taken one course on Dead Sea Scrolls with the Bible scholar Nachum Sarna. And then when I was looking for doctoral dissertation topic, so I was trying to find a way to combine studies that I did in Tanakh, and, and that is biblical studies, and also in Talmudic studies. And someone said, why don't you do the Dead Sea Scrolls? So I basically tried it. And I took one of my doctoral exams in one of the Dead Sea Scrolls texts and then went on to write a dissertation on the question of halakha in the Dead Sea Scrolls, Jewish law. Now, then I figured I might move on to something else. I didn't really yet get the point that it would become the mainstream of my activity. What then happened is that after I wrote a second study on Jewish law in the Dead Sea Scrolls, the scrolls as an overall field became much more significant and got much more attention. And it became pretty obvious that I was in the Dead Sea Scrolls to stay, one might say. And that's what happened. 